The Chinese government is striving to reduce liquidity to combat inflation. Official statistics show China's new yuan-denominated loans in September hit the lowest in 20 months, and the money supply grew at the slowest pace in almost a decade. China Report has the details. According to the People's Bank of China or the Central Bank, new yuan-denominated loans stood at 73.7 billion U.S. dollars in September. The amount represented a drop of about 20.6 billion dollars from the same month last year and 12.3 billion dollars from August this year, creating the lowest since January 2010. Total new loans in the first nine months of this year was about 920 billion dollars, 93.7 billion dollars less than the same period last year. The central bank has raised interest rates three times this year and hiked the reserve requirement ratio for commercial banks six times to mop up excessive liquidity to ease inflation. China's Consumer Price Index, or CPI, a main gauge of inflation, climbed 6.1 percent year-on-year in September, easing slightly from 6.2 percent in August. On a monthly basis, consumer prices rose 0.5 percent last month. The Chinese government's full-year inflation target was around 4 percent for 2011. The central bank also says the Chinese foreign exchange reserves totaled 3.2017 trillion U.S. dollars at the end of September, compared with 3.1975 trillion U.S. dollars at the end of June.